Hello guys, welcome back. On January 29, AI at Meta released the Code Llama 70 billion, a new, more performant version of our LLM for code generation, right? In this video, I will show you what, how does this model compares with other existing models out there and how to run this model locally as well as how can you quickly test this model online. Let's get started. Okay, as you can see here, this is the Twitter page of AI at Meta. And if you want to download the model, you need to go to this particular link. Here, you need to request access. But if you don't want to download it locally, there are many ways how you can test this, right? There are three things, Code Llama 70B, Code Llama 70B Python, and Code Llama 70B Instruct model, right? Yeah, if I go inside this, as you can see here, it says Code Llama 70B Instruct achieves 67.8 on human eval, right? How this model is different from other models, right? For that, what we can do is, let's say we can go to the hogging chart. I will show you first how you can, what is this model different from other models first, right? As you can see, this is the hogging chart and I will show you how you can go to this place later on. But there is this Code Llama, Code Llama 70B Instruct HF, right? Here, if I go to the model website, this is the website, right? Introducing the Code Llama, a state-of-the-art language model for coding, right? If you scroll a bit down and all the way down here, it says, okay, here is the Llama 2. And this is the foundation uh, models, 7B, 13B, 34B, and 70B, right? As you can see here, there is this Python code training, and then there is this long context fine tuning, and there is long context fine tuning 20B tokens. This is 20B tokens. And here you can see there is the instruction fine tuned 5 billion tokens. There is this code llama Python, there is code llama instruct, and this is the code llama that I just showed you three different versions of the model. You can go here and just read this page. But one thing, the interesting thing here is here, as you can see, it is highlighted also. For example, in the human eval, you can see that the code llama instruct achieves 67.8 compared to let's say GPT-4, which was the initial version of GPT-4, 67. Similarly for MBPP, here it says 65.C in the code llama Python. Similarly, 45.9 in the multilingual human eval, right? Based on this, it seems that for, let's say with the human eval also, it seems that the Code Llama instruct model, which I'm going to show you in different platforms, beats, let's say the base GPT-4 model, right? For more details, you can just go here and read all the detailed things. But now you get the idea that this model is capable or let's say is more uh, good than GPT-4 in some cases, according to the report that they are showing there, right? Now the question is, let me first go how to run this model locally, right? For that, we can use Olama. I have already created videos on Olama, how to install this and how to download models from the Olama page. But if you don't want to follow that also, it's quite easy, just download this. And there is this models tab here. And you can just source different models here. We can just say here Code Llama, spelling mistake. Code Llama, as you can see, it is updated 13 hours ago. So also here, okay, what is this? And 7 billion, 13 billion, 34 billion, and 70 billion, as I just showed you before, and how to use it, and all the different things are mentioned here, right? But if you want to go to the tag section here, yeah, you can go here and just copy the model that you want to download and then go to the terminal make sure you have olama installed if you run olama in the terminal if it shows something like this it is installed and you can see olama list the models that are listed and i didn't download this but this is how you can download for example if you want the code llama 70b code quantized uh, q2k two bit things you can just run right like this and it will uh, pull the model from there and then you can just start uh, running it as I said you before also, if you want to have more in-depth things, please refer to my Olama video. That's it. That's how you can run the Olama locally. But it's not that uh, all of you have the hardware that is required to run this model because this small model is 25 GBB. As you can see here, this is the quantization things. If you go to the 70p, there is 39 GB, 39 GB, there is 39 GB. And if you go down here, to the 70b let me go to the 70b part here 
uh, where is it you can see there are so many different models here so you can just scroll down here there are 57 b they say that i just want to go in some of this q1 q2 q3 means the quantization for example i was going to this one right if i go inside this it says here model family is llama and parameter 69b quantization 2 bit it was updated 22 hours ago so you can find more information by going inside the tags and finding the right models right okay this is how you can run this locally but what are the websites that you can run these big models just for free and try if it performs better or not first one which i recommend is to first check the hogging chart which is from hogging face right as you can see here this is the hogging chart and if you if you go to this current model and this settings icon here it will all the different models that are listed here for example this code llama code llama 70b instruct if you go inside this it will show you the model page the model website and all the different things you can just activate this this is the active model it is saved and you can just close this now it is here and you can just go ahead and ask any question let's say that i want to have how to upload data to s3 bucket simple things right here create a s3 bucket and all the different things will be provided here i think with the hogging chat without creating the account you can just have a couple of uh, couple of questions and then you need to log in but what if you don't want to log in right there is the another website which i recommend you to check apart from this hogging chat that is the perplexity labs i have explained uh, let's say this perplexity in different videos also yeah on the down here you can choose the models for example here is perplexity 7b online if you click on this you can choose different models and here is the code llama 70b instruct model we can ask the same questions let me see i can go to the chat here and i can just ask the same question here right Control c go to the perplexity labs go here Control v enter and as you can see here this is quite fast compared to the hugging chat right and yeah you can see this is code llama quite fast we know that it is working correctly by just going through this you can check it if it works or not and that's it you can you can now go and play with this code llama online for free and one thing also which i recommend you to check is the hugging face website and the block right as you can see here, there are different quantization versions of models and as you can see here just updated a minute ago let me refresh the page i think this is updated some minutes ago yeah updated two minutes ago there is the code llama 70b instruct gguf if you are into the llm fields i recommend you to just bookmark these websites that i just mentioned you so that you can just quickly go and test the different models because whenever there is some new model appearing on the market let's say these are the websites that let's say uh, in the, they just have these models into their platform let's say in that way and these are the websites that i personally check in the beginning yeah i hope now you get the idea way to run not only called llama but if there is some new models out in the market just check these websites then you are good to go yeah i hope this is this all makes clear now and you know how to run these big models locally and free right thank you for watching and see you in the next video